All right, so before this video starts, I am decent to let you know. If you know, you know. I took down the video. Um, if you have questions about it, leave a comment and someone will help you. This is a different type of video. I have never, I don't think I've ever seen a Hiccup X listener thing, and I know what you're thinking. Uh, nighttime, your voice is a little deep to do it. Well, considering that I look like Hiccup, or at least the hiccup in this photo, I think I am deemed worthy to try. And what's, you know, how fun would it be for me to attempt a Jay Barrett shell voice? Yeah. So, let me know. I am a remote voice actor, but that does not mean I'm perfect at anything. Everything. I'm a little, I'm a little wired. So, if you can't really stand the way I sound and it doesn't really click with you, then I'm, you know, I'm not Jay Baruchel. I'm not Hiccup. So if you can't already stand this nasally nonsense you want to call a Hiccup impression, you are free to click on another video of mine. There are 400. Just like there are 400 dragon types, including the Night Fury. I'm doing my best. So... Enjoy the audio, and like always, it's improvised, so there's ums, uhs, and uns. And I'm literally going to mute my mic and unmute it and try and make something out of this. So, enjoy. Do you think I'd be able to... Grow a beard like he did? Um, I'm, of course, referring to Toothless over there, but... I'm never gonna be the ruler he was. One day... I will have to look upon my own children on... Burke and... How... Will I be able to tell them the stories of what we accomplished, what I alone started? I'm glad I have you here at the very least to guide me and keep me here mentally through and through with all this nonsense we have to put up with. I mean, the feeders are never full. Other Vikings are never happy. There's no more room for dragons. I, I don't quite know how far we can go with this going forward. But we will... We'll do the best we can with what we got, and... I, I, I have you, and thank Odin Almighty that I was able to stumble across you. <clears throat> yeah. And by All Father's beard, if you told me that I'd one day see my mother again, then... You told me, oh, she's a great dragon trainer. I would never, I would never believe you. I'm just, just antsy to find a whole new world, find a whole new purpose, a whole new reason. But, granted, perhaps I should start spending that time with making you my purpose, you know? Why can't we just make my mom a chief? Is that illegal? Is that against Viking rule? If I could bend the rules and tame a dragon, then what are rules about the wife of the chief becoming said chief? Who knows? But I know that I would love to spend 
and the rest of Valhalla just gazing upon your eyes. I've never been the cool guy or anything. The moment people started catching on to my dragon training, they were quite literally just, I think, talking to me to be ahead of the game. We'll never know. But I do know the true intentions of the people I hold close, whether it's fish legs, rough nut, tough nut, you know, you will have to move on and understand why people like Drago or People like that, why do they, why ex they exist? I think by chance the All Father created a way for us to move forward and dragon training was a challenge that we accomplished and we came together and made it work, but I don't know. I don't want to put toothless in any more danger I don't want to put you in any more danger I just I just feel like at this point I'm going on about nonsense I don't even know what to call it in due time we will we will figure it out One thing is for sure, though, I need to figure out how to wash out dragon slobber. That's another... I'll put it at the bottom of my to-do list. Honestly, it just gets everywhere. Whatever. I'm, I'm rambling about nothing. We will figure it out, and we will find a way together. And we will be ready. After all, this... This is Burke. We'll... We'll find a way. And I love that I have you here with me. To help the soothing sounds of dragons flying by my house every five minutes. Whether it's sunfall or moonrise, they're always out and about, exploring, finding new worlds and new purposes. But yes, I do think some rest would do us very good, so why don't we take this rest, let Toothless do whatever Toothless does, and, well, we'll go from there. I love you. And as long as I have you, I will have a purpose 